Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. CodingFace.com, your boy is back and out and did it again. Guys, listen, we have a very precise list for you guys this year. The top 20 developers that you should be following according to the peoples, all right? Now, this list is basically made of 8,000 people who actually filled out this form. You know, people got coming from Udemy, people who are coming from YouTube, people who are coming from my website, people who are coming from Facebook groups, people who are coming from social media, all right? This is not just people from my audience, this is people spread out, all right? More than half of the people are out of my audience. This is literally people from, you know, from online, right? And people who actually come in and are part of the community. So we want to give them a voice, okay? So we're going to start this like this. We're going to start with the honorable mentions, all right? Then I'm going to give you the top 20. And then after that, we're going to go into a little bit more deeper behind the scenes of this top 20. Twenty coding channels you must follow. Twenty eighteen. Ah. Okay, so top honorable mentions. We got John Morris, Sentex, Black Knight, Coding, uh, West Boss, Krista Freelancer. All right, so let's get to it. Top twenty. Ricky Garcia, four point five percent of the audience likes his content. Uh, the Net Ninja, 4.9%, like this content. Start Here FM, 5.7%. Number 17, Real Tough Candy, 6.1%. Number 16, Michael Thomas, 6.5%. Number 15, Programming with Eric, 8.6%. The Real Casadero, 11%. At number 14. Number 13, Roosberry, 13.5%. Number 12, Aaron and Beta, 16.3%. Number 11, Coat Course, 19.1%. Number 10, Stefan Mischuk, basically 20%. Number 9, The Coding Train. 21.2%. Number 8, Chris Sean, 22.4%. Number 7, Chris Hawks, 22.9%. Number 6, Level Up Tuts, 23.3%. Number 5, Simple Programmer, 23.7%. Number four, fun, fun function with 24.3% of the audience liking his content. Number three, coding tutorials 360, 38.2% of the audience added him to his favorites. Okay. Number two, coding phase 66.5%. It's going to be controversial, but hey, it is what it is, you know. Number one, which is Traversy Media, which to nobody is a secret that Traversy Media had a great year this year. So congratulations to him, you know, more power to him, you know, and I hope everything goes good, man. 2018, hopefully, you know, we have a more, um, how you call this, a more fair list and like I said from the beginning, I told everybody, I sent it out. I sent out emails to every single one of these guys here. Everybody that shows up here, they got an email from me. Either a message, a comment, an email, something. They got something from me. All right? And we did it live. So you guys have, uh, you know, are basically my witnesses. All right? So we basically reached out to everybody live and we told them, Hey, man, share this link with your audience. But as you guys may know, you know, a lot of times, most of, you know, 99% of every developer who's on YouTube is pretty much thinking like everybody's trying to feed off them and trying to steal their audience. And, you know, pretty much there's no community here. 
All right. So hopefully with this list next year, everybody decides to come together and as a community, we could create a poll. Same way how Stack Overflow has their yearly poll. Well, I want to create one. I want to create one because we all have a great and uh, we have a huge audience, man. Like we could literally come in and get data from them, find out exactly what they want, what type of content they want. Do they want more uh, tutorials? Do they want more, uh, you know, personality? You know, like one thing that you're going to notice here is, of course, Traverse Media is number one because he's given so much content, so much great content for everybody. All right. Now. Me, myself, you might say, hey, Joe, it's your poll. You came out number two. But you got to understand, more than half of the people that voted on this poll, no, they're not my subscribers. Only like 400 people from my subscribers actually voted for this poll. Then everybody else is from emails from Udemy, which is just random people. It's not people that uh, they're signed up to me. They're just people who are pretty much just random. But they've heard of my channel somehow. Right. So they enjoy the type of content I come in. I feel like what I bring into the table is the personality and at the same time, just the realness, which people they like, and, you know, and at the same time, you got coding tutorials 360. You know, there's other channels here on the list that have way more subscribers than him. But as you can see, the community attaches more to him. They like him more than those other YouTubers who have greater or uh, numbers than him so it shows you from this uh, data that we have here is what exactly is that people care about you know because the whole poll said which ones are your favorites you know like you might have a channel that you might go and use for tutorials and use it as a reference or use it like a uh, documentation but doesn't mean that you connect with that channel one thing that coding tutorials 360, as you could tell, he connects with the people. All right. People could connect to him and, you know, they like his content. So out of this list, you could take in that if I was looking from the outside in, I would say, hey, people want more content. People want more free content, right? That's what Traverses Media is here. They like the fact that I come in and share my personality and share you know who I am so they care about who this developer is and they care about the things that you know coding tutorials 360 comes in and brings to the table so everybody else who's here you know everybody brings something different to the table some people are more for vlogging some people are more for advice some people are more for uh, you know tutorials people use their channel as a documentation but we must agreeing one thing is hey there's things that people are looking for right on their channels to consider them their favorites okay so what i would say is take this list look at the things that every single one of them have this is not a top list of who's the best who is the most popular who has the most subscribers this has nothing to do with that this has to do with who are the people connecting to more all right. And who's actually providing them more content and better content than everybody else. You get what I'm saying? So I hope that everybody enjoys this list. I hope you guys uh, really come in next year. And, you know, when we sit down next year, uh, next December, we could have more YouTubers because pretty much the only two people that actually responded back was the real Casadaro and Ricky Garcia besides them nobody else responded back so that's on them you know what I mean like I come in and I try to create a impartial list I come in and go out of my way to make sure that I'm bringing in people who are not on my subscribers list at all and just to have a more decent and more uh, fair list you know because this is data you know, this is day that that we could all use and come in here and, you know, give the next year a better content for everybody. All right. So love you guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you guys that are watching this, you guys go check out every single one of this shows. 
all right? The, everybody here has something different. Everybody, you know, they either talk about Python, they talk about vlogs, they talk about uh, tutorials, they either talk about their lives or, you know, how they became developers. Like, every single one of them has great content. So go check them out, especially the honorable mentions. Usually when you have people in the honorable mentions, this is like the hidden, you know, the hidden secrets. The guys that not everybody know about, but one of you guys actually voted for them to be on this list. So, yeah, I'll see you guys later. It's your boy Joe. Back at it again. CodingFace.com. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you like this video. Bye. Guys, this video is brought to you by viewers like you and people that support our website, CodingFace.com. Go check it out. Over 20 courses in there that's going to guide you to become a developer from the beginning to becoming a pro, making sure that you get a job, making sure that you come in and you learn all the skills on how to make money on your own as an independent, either a freelancer or if you decide to make passive income. All right, go check us out. Peace.